all right all right so welcome again good morning to you guys um thank you very much for watching um again so this is actually a quick quick update um on jamal law so apparently there's some situations surrounding jamal law in the in the fc bournemouth the cherries that's what they're called the cherry squad and he's now heavily linked with um a numerous amount of clubs so we're going to get into the details people won't waste any time that's what we're here for let's go straight over to it um as i said watford um lead chase to sign attacker bournemouth attacker let's get it watford are leading the chase for bournemouth jamal low with the cherries being open to letting letting him leave on a loan this summer transfer window uh, football league world was told so this information is from football league world let's continue Low seems to have fallen out of favor at Bournemouth this year with them back in the Premier League under Scott Parker and that and that looks set to, to trigger at least a temporary departure. Indeed, um, this site has been told that Cherries are open to letting him leave on a loan before the end of the summer window and several Skybet Championship sites are keen, look, um, keen on bringing him in. Um, it is Watford who are leading the chase for his signature at the moment though with this site being told that the Arnets are ahead of Norwich, Burnley and Sunderland who have all shown an interest in trying to sign low in this window. A player that helped Bournemouth achieve promotion last year and also shown his class regularly in his Skybet Championship. It's no surprise to hear several teams are keen on bringing him in. Time will tell also whether he ends up wherever or however with just over a week left in current transfer window now another player i want us to touch on is uh, before i move away from that um is um shamar nicholson so at, at, at as it's done it seems as if shamar nicholson um what the heck it seems as if shamar nicholson um transfer in regards to galatasaray is a bit on hold uh because shamar did came out and said that hey i love it at spartak moscow so basically they're saying that shaman shaman nicholson clear the air that's what they're saying that shaman nicholson clear the air in regards to that aspect but there's a lot of stories in regards to what is really happening some stories are saying that some reports are saying that the deal is done and just pending official announcement or no it's pending official I think they said the deal is complete on the club side it's on the club side but they need to start out some paperwork but it's not it's not it's not clear there's a lot of talks going on let me see if i can find one of the stories um good this is one of this is one of them um galatasaray put the transfer of um, norwegian defender um andreas Oren olens and jamaican shamar nicholson on hold which um which with which they have been reached an agreement in principle so as i said there's a lot of different stories coming out and let me see if i can find one more, another one of those are so this one is the latest one from gala um one of the latest one let's see what he's saying agreement has been reached with um hollison and shaman nicholson it can end at any moment exactly see? so there's a lot of mixed report coming out there's a lot of mixed report coming out um so this is from lion report as well most of them are quoting from um, for, uh, from other aspects, other places. Galarta Sarap with the transfer of Norwegian defender and Jamaican strike on hold, which they already have reached an agreement in principle. So that's what I'm talking about. And then Shamar Nicholson, uh, maybe about a day ago, came out stating that, um, said that, okay, so this is Galarta Sarai Fox. So they are one of the most credible um, reporters on Galarta So this is what I said so it's, it's it's the same thing so all of them are, are quoting the same basic thing um that the transfer is on all in which so for shamar i do think that um this this move to galatasaray could be one in which um i think would be a good move i think it's 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 a, sl a step away from the, the from that league another this is another art another article um another transfer aspects where they get proper proper transfer um uh, on news reports accurate i should say these players will report to dp uh, pdp unless better alternatives are found um shaman nicholson and anche have finished their signings see so 
as I said, people, there's there's a lot of a lot of mixed report, but most definitely, I'm just dropping these guys, dropping these um updates to you guys, so you guys can know what is really happening. Jamalo, um, Watford is close to signing reggae boy Jamalo, um, Bornley, um, Norwich and um Sunderland are the teams who are in for Jamalo and now Shamar Nicholson still finer details in regards to what is happening with Shamar Nicholson a lot of mixed reports some are saying the deal is finished some are saying the deal is on hold and it was actually a, um a, um verified in principle but we saw this one um materialize and uh, uh, uh is it materialize is it materialize we'll see how it materialize <laughs> going forward and definitely once we get more reports we'll drop it and let you guys have it and know what is happening these are the reports that are coming out definitely want to keep an eye on um specifically um with with with, with um jamalo and shamar nicholson so there's other reports as well but i i try to keep it to those reports those articles that i've seen because I, those persons are persons that we can say they have a little bit of reliableness on um, we can rely on them just a little bit a little bit more and uh, than, than the norm so I will keep you guys updated i will definitely keep you guys updated on this one because as i said this one is one to look at and most definitely so people I'll see you guys again hopefully you guys are doing good until next time mg sports tv people we're out have a good day people like share and subscribe